some types of anxiety, like severe test anxiety or severe school refusal, could be pointing at bigger problems. School and stress for many students, the two go hand in hand. Getting adjusted to a new school year can take some time. Students worry about a lot of things, including getting along with others, taking tests, or even being homesick. Yeah, they may even try refusing to go to school. 27 First News reporter Greta Mitterator looked into how parents can help ease children's fears. For some students, the return to school can come with anxiety. Laura Abels with Akron Children's Hospital Mahoning Valley says parents may notice their child's pattern change at home. They don't want to get up and they don't want to go to school and they might be waking up with nightmares. Abels says there are three common types of school-related anxiety to look out for. The first is social, where they're afraid to interact with new friends or in a new environment. The second, performance. They're worried about participating in class or taking a test. And the third, separation. They struggle to be apart from home and family. Abel says making sure your child is prepared and organized for each school day can help ease their anxiety. Laying out your clothes, making sure you have your lunch packed, knowing where your book bag is and where your shoes are because you don't want that mad scramble in the morning. It's also important to focus on time management. They know what time they need to be getting ready for bed. They know what time they need to be laying down going to sleep. They know how many hours they're going to be sleeping, and we really recommend 8 to 10 hours for kids. And they know what time they have to get out of bed. If the anxiety persists or becomes more severe, Abel suggests seeking professional help. You want somebody to be able to help your child open up and talk about their feelings or their issues and then learn to cope with those things. Reporting for WKBN 27 First News, I'm Greta Mitterrater.